Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to fix Windows updates if they're not installing properly or they're not installing at all. So in this brief tutorial it will be a pretty straightforward walkthrough and we're going to jump right into it. And we're going to start by heading over to the start menu. And you want to type in File Explorer. Should be listed as a desktop app on Windows 10, earlier versions of Windows should just say File Explorer. So you want to left click on that. You want to head over to this PC on the left side if you're using Windows 10. On Windows 7 I believe it is called Computer. You want to left click on it. And then underneath Devices and Drives you want to open up your local disk. In most cases it will be the C drive for you guys. So you want to double click on that. Once you've done that, what you want to head over to would be Windows. Click on the Windows folder by double clicking on it. Now you want to scroll down until you get to Software Distribution. Right here. And you want to right click on it. Go down to the near the bottom of this menu where it says Rename and left click on that. And now add a dot old extension to it. So software so it should say software distribution dot old. Click out of it to save our changes here. And we can see the action cannot be completed because the folder or file is open in another program, meaning that the Windows Update Service is still running, which is okay. Okay, so what we're gonna have to do is restart our computer to access this. So all we have to do, depending on what version of Windows you're running, is a little bit different. Windows 7 users can just tap F8 while the computer is restarting. Windows 10, if you actually restart your computer and you hold down the shift key while you left click on restart. So again, shift plus restart. It'll restart you into safe mode. Left click on Troubleshoot, left click on Advanced Options, so now you want to left click on the Startup Settings tile, left click on the Restart button right here. So underneath startup settings, you want to hit F5 on your keyboard. So again, F5, you want to hit enter. This will launch safe mode with networking. So again, this will just take a moment, so just be patient. Windows 7 users should not experience this. It should be a lot easier to get into safe mode. Okay, so at this point you'd enter your user account password. And now we're going to navigate over to the same spot that we were in before. And we're going to either search up File Explorer on the Start menu or click on the icon on the desktop. I'm going to go underneath this PC, local disk, I'm going to go underneath Windows, and now I'm going to scroll down to software distribution, right click on it, left click on rename, add a dot old extension to the end of it, and then hit enter. And then at this point, what you can do is close out of this window, restart the computer into the normal Windows operating system, which it should do automatically, and you should be good to go. So I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out, and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.